presenting a freehold boutique development space at Coven by the SGX main board listed Roxy Pacific Holdings. <music> Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Veroy from The Real Collective and today we are continuing our journey down the northeast line from Hongo to Sengkang and today we are at Coven. So if you are new to our channel, do like and subscribe to our channel because we don't want you to miss out all the beautiful houses and the historical fun facts of Singapore's real estate, alright? Now Coven is a neighbourhood located within Aokang and the early Teochews used to call this Kobun as Kao Wen, so you can actually know that this location is as Teochew as Aokang itself. And suddenly a Teochew saying came to my mind. Teochew nang ka ang ang, Hokkien nang ka sen tang. <laughs> okay, I'm sure my editing crew will edit out this uh, what I've just said, but if you know what I'm trying to say, right? Please put it down in the comment box below, okay? So fun fact for you guys, so Coven used to be known as Lakko Chio, which translates as Six milestone and in fact in the past usually people use the Singapore General Post Office as a reference point to where their location is so Coven is in fact six milestones away from the SGPO which is now the Fullerton Hotel so SGPO Singapore General Post Office was used to mark the center of the city center of Singapore and in the past that used to be known as Po Tui and in Mandarin is known as Alright, but today we are not here to talk about Po Tui, Lako, Chiko or Pueko. We are actually here to talk about Coven. So if you are interested to find out a little bit more about Singapore's real estate history, do stay tuned to our channel because that's what we're going to bring you this year. The Coven neighbourhood today largely consists of private housing where majority of the residents live in terraces, semi-detached, bungalows and private apartments. Speaking of which, we have a great buy for you that is under 800,000 with a wide range of possible configurations to optimise its use. And it is a 1 plus 1 at a space at Coven, a freehold mixed development. So, over here we are strategically located along Yo Chu Kang Road where you are nested between two mega shopping malls, Next at Serangoon and the Heartland Mall at Coven. Over there, you can have all your shopping needs fulfilled. First stop, it only takes 10 minutes stroll to reach the exciting next shopping mall which has a wide variety of fancy restaurant, 24-hour fair price supermarket, cinema and more. There you will also enjoy the superb convenience of Serangoon MRT off the northeast line which brings you right to Dhobi Ghat in 30 minutes. And if that's not enough, you can take a bus that's just right outside the development which will bring you to the popular Coven Food Centre and Heartland Mall. Now don't get me started with the wide array of famous Singapore delicacies over there. Spoilt for choices, that's not all. You can even hang out at the awesome Serangoon Garden which is just a 12 minutes ride away. And over here, this is actually touted as uh, District 19's Holland Village where you have upmarket dining options, fancy restaurant, hipsters bar and more. Which is perfect for us to chill out an evening for you to relax, perfect for professionals like you, you and you. Okay, so right now follow me to the unit that we are going to show you today. Let's go. Welcome to the unit guys. So this is a 549 square feet, a one plus study which I'm going to be sharing with you later on how you can maximize the potential of the space. This efficiently built space is kept in an immaculate condition and furnished with style by a very very house proud owner. Alright, so we are here at the kitchenette space of the unit and this space itself has been unused since day one since the owner doesn't cook at all. The owner has also reconfigured this space for maximum practicality. In the past right here used to be a built-in fridge which the owner has removed and configured a space over here for the microwave oven. Right next to it, you have your washing area and if you're someone who prefers to machine dry your clothes, you can actually stack up your dryer right on top to ensure you have the best of both worlds, okay? Now back into the unit. So here right, we are facing towards the northeast orientation. That would mean that you don't get any afternoon sun and in addition, you still get a good supply of breeze coming into the unit. And of course from here right, you have a balcony that faces towards the open area that's being flanked by awesome greeneries which is perfect for you to just relax 
and enjoy a little bit of afternoon tea. Okay, so the corridor serves as a privacy buffer between your living and your personal space and it's also a great place for you guys to hang up art pieces just like what the owner has done over here. Okay, so this is the study room which we will not be featuring today due to privacy as this is the owner's workspace and for his business. But both bedrooms are decked out in timber floors and they share a similar view from the living room itself. Just like the living area, bedrooms are facing towards the northeast with no afternoon sun. I believe this might sound trivial but this is really really important to many people. I'm already seeing how we could configure this room for a more personalised space for some of you. We'll share with you momentarily. Now remember I mentioned the possible configurations for maximise comfort or maximise you. If you are a home buyer or investor, do stay on. Alright, here we go. Essentially, this is a one plus study and unlike other developments where the study room is just an open corner, this one has a proper enclosed study room with windows bringing in the lights. Now this is big enough to be a guest room or a second bedroom. And if you are one who loves an expensive living area, remove this wall, extend this space to the living area and perhaps even have a pool table over here. And if you are a fashionista and you have fancy more wardrobe space, you could take down this wall hot this up and now you have yourself a nice walk-in closet. And in view of young professionals having difficulty uh, finding accommodation in Singapore due to the limited supply, you could also convert the living room into another bedroom. BAM! Now three young professionals can rent this unit and you can enjoy the maximum view of 4%. I call this great cash flow if that's what you're looking for. So if you're looking to visit this freehold, well-maintained one plus study unit located at Space at Coven, you know who to call. Contact Veroy from The Real Collective. Real people, real estate, real results and we'll see you soon.